Royal Caribbean's unlimited drink packages offer a tremendous value and budget-friendly option for guests who want to enjoy all the beverages they care for while on their cruise vacation. And today, I've got the do's and don'ts of Royal Caribbean's drink packages up next. Hey everybody, it's Matt from RoyalCaribbeanBlog.com and today I'm sharing some helpful advice on the best ways to take advantage of a Royal Caribbean drink package. There's a lot of great reasons to get a drink package and if you are thinking of getting one, already decided to buy one, here's five do's and don'ts of Royal Caribbean's drink package. Let's talk about the do's first. Number one, do pre-purchase it. The best way to get the lowest price on an unlimited drink package is to buy it before the cruise. Royal Caribbean regularly offers pre-cruise discounts via its cruise planner site. Plus, you can cancel and rebook if the price drops before your cruise. The next thing you should do is do your research. Before you decide to buy a drink package, have an honest conversation with yourself if you really think you'll be able to drink enough every day of your cruise to make the investment worthwhile. Drink packages offer a great value, but it does require you to drink enough every day of your cruise to make it a good buy. The next thing you definitely wanna do is specify the liquor brand. When you order a drink, be sure to specify the liquor. In lieu of ordering a Bloody Mary, you wanna say a Bloody Mary with Grey Goose Vodka. Your unlimited alcohol package includes a variety of liquor, so don't just settle for the first bottle available to the bartender. Another thing you wanna do with the drink package is try new drinks. One of the best reasons to get a drink package is to be able to try out a new drink. It's completely acceptable to try a drink and not finish them, so feel free to experiment without fear of wasting a drink. And the last do is to use it at perfect day at Coco Key and Labadee. Royal Caribbean's drink packages benefits work at both of its private destinations, so your drink package value will dramatically increase if your cruise happens to visit one of these ports. Now let's go to the five drink package don'ts. Don't share the drink package. The cardinal faux pas of any drink package is to share its benefits with other guests. The drink package benefits are only for the person that buys it, so do not share it with anyone else, period. Also, don't over tip. Your drink package covers gratuity for any and all drinks you order with it. While you certainly can tip extra if you so choose, you should be aware that your drink package orders already account for gratuity. The next thing you don't want to do with a drink package is assume you need one. Drink packages get a lot of attention in videos like this among cruisers, and as a result, many new cruisers seem to feel like they need to get one because of all the talk drink packages get. The reality is you don't need a drink package. There's lots of complimentary beverages included with your cruise and drink packages are a nice to have splurge, but far from a necessity. The next thing you don't want to do with a drink package is overlook non-alcoholic beverages. You know, if you have the deluxe beverage package, AKA the unlimited alcohol package, be sure to take advantage of all the non-alcoholic beverages it includes. Lattes, bottled water, soda, espresso, juice, and more are all included with your deluxe beverage package. And quite frankly, it's just as important as the booze that comes with it. And the last thing you don't want to do with your unlimited drink package is forget that it works, especially restaurants. Royal Caribbean specialty restaurants have their share of signature cocktails, as well as a full array of alcoholic and non-alcoholic drinks. And your drink package benefits work there too. So take advantage of it. So there you go, five easy do's and don'ts of Royal Caribbean's unlimited drink packages. Hope you liked this video. If you did, give this video a thumbs up. And while you're down there, be sure to subscribe and turn on your notifications of this channel so that way YouTube will let you know as soon as we post a brand new video. This is Matt from RoyalCaribbeanBlog.com and we'll talk again real soon.